Be glass. Hello viewers. Welcome to another episode of hiking and cooking in the English countryside. Today, I mean Cookham. I think that's the name of the area. I'll be cooking at the end as well. So yeah, just watch the video, enjoy, like, share, and subscribe. I know I've been missing for a few weeks now, actually, due to circumstances beyond my control. Just one of those things, but I'm back now, and I'll be bringing you lovely videos as usual. So, yeah, stick by enjoy the video I think these fruits are edible not too sure so I won't be trying them but I've seen a few and, uh, and someone was eating them but I'm not too sure if it's the same fruit so I won't be trying them and don't take my word for it it's not a good idea to just go around picking these wild berries because a lot of times you'll see some that look similar that is poisonous so I won't be trying it if anyone know what they are or if they are edible leave it in the comment section thanks couldn't walk some more. First, I didn't expect the day to be warm. It was forecast for rain. Well, that's what it said. That's what they told us that it would be raining. But it's definitely not. It's nice and sunny. Quiet, peaceful, lovely. Cookham is located in the county of Berkshire, southeast England, two miles north of the town of Maidenhead, five miles south of High Wycombe, and 26 miles from London. So viewers, today it's going to be some salt fish and spaghetti, or macaroni if some would say. I don't want to waste too much time cooking, so try and make things much easier for myself and I didn't take my cutting board trying to yeah I'm trying to travel with less weight This is a salt fish, I've already pre-cooked, washed it, removed the salt.
Et pour le temps. Black pepper. Time. Like I said, already pre cook the salt fish, remove all the salt, break it up. You know, when you're doing it at home, it's a bit different, but out here in the bush, you don't have all the time, so you try and do it the easy way. don't have everything that I would like to have with me at the moment didn't bring any sweet pepper which I love my sweet pepper all purpose seasoning this here is a bit of butter bean One thing I really forget and is my pepper. I didn't bring in a pepper sauce or any scotch bonnet pepper. So that's the macaroni. I wish I had a little bit of coconut cream. getting windy don't know if it's going to rain hopefully not before I finish with the cooking handle up the pot is hot So viewers, as usual, don't forget LMT, leave no trace. Yep, Let's leave the place nice and clean, just like it was when you got here. Nice and clean. This is where I did the cooking, and I side of the place and I'm off whoa look at the size of those wasps it's a huge wasp nest in there I can't get too close because they're flying around me big wasp I really enjoy these walks here. Yeah. I must say, for the most part, it's lovely. People are kind and friendly. Well, every now and then you may meet a one individual who, soon as I see you, they start squeezing up the face as if it's hurting them. But apart from that, most people uh, come along. I mean, most people that I see on the path. Time to say good morning, 
try to give me direction yeah and I enjoyed like I say it's on the one of you made me at one person who seems for whatever reason not happy 